formaldehyde. What is it? Where does it come from? Why is it dangerous? And lastly, how can you reduce your family's exposure to formaldehyde in your home? Formaldehyde is a colorless, strong-smelling chemical that is used in many common products. At room temperature, formaldehyde vaporizes out of the product and into your home's air. This is called off-gassing. One of the primary uses of formaldehyde is in building materials like pressed wood products such as particle board and plywood, engineered flooring, insulation, furniture, paints, adhesives, and floor finishes. How is it harmful? Symptoms of formaldehyde exposure can be difficult to identify because they are similar to common cold and flu symptoms. Studies show that when formaldehyde levels exceed 100 parts per billion, some individuals may experience adverse health effects, such as watery eyes, burning sensation in the eyes, nose, and throat, coughing, wheezing, nausea, and skin irritation. Emerging evidence shows that formaldehyde can lead to the development of asthma in children. It is also a known cancer-causing agent or carcinogen. So, what can you do to limit your exposure to formaldehyde in your home? Increase ventilation, lower the indoor temperatures, reduce the humidity levels, avoid purchasing furniture made with plywood or particle board, allow any new items to air out or off-gas outdoors before placing them in the home, and ensure that your appliances, such as the stove, furnace, and fireplace, are properly vented. Since formaldehyde is in so many common household products, you can never fully eliminate it from your air, but you can and should keep the levels in your home as low as possible.